In this video, I wanted to provide an introduction to problem set two, which is all going to be concerning the sort of basics of least squares estimation and interpreting least squares estimates. So the practical element here is hopefully going to be quite fun. The practical element here is going to be investigating the factors which affect NBA players' wages. And I should mention here that this data actually comes very gracefully from Jeffrey Waldridge, who has allowed this data to be used in this particular course. So thank you very much, Professor Waldridge. And this particular practical element here is going to be investigating the concepts of heteroscedasticity. So we're going to be looking, focusing here really on how we graphically decide whether we have heteroscedasticity. We're also going to be looking at the concept of multicollinearity and how that affects our results. So that's going to be our sort of practical element here. And actually at the end of this as well, we are, well, the last sort of problem here is to make your own model. So I call this the sort of freestyle section because I've provided the data and the idea here is that I'm hoping that you'll go ahead and you'll try and design your own model which explains NBA players' wages as best as possible. So that's a little bit of a fun bit at the end there anyway. And the idea here as well is that there is a theoretical section and in this theoretical section, we're going to be looking at the issues of heteroscedasticity and multicollinearity. And we're also going to be looking at the issue of endogeneity. And I hope that you'll find that this theoretical section isn't necessarily just too theoretic. It's also relatively applied, or some questions are relatively applied. So it's not too far removed from reality. I should mention as well that I am providing the answers to this particular problem set from the same link which you can actually get the original problem set and the original data set. So as soon as you're done with the particular problem set, you can compare your answers to the written answers which I'm providing. Anyway, I hope you enjoy it and please leave me any feedback you have about it.